Hey, I want you to give it up for this first comic. He is very funny, and not only that, he has a master's degree. Let's hear it for Chris Oliver. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. How are we doing tonight? I'm Chris Oliver, and I, I teach English as a second language. It's my, my day job, uh, and I have a lot of Chinese students, and some of them have had English classes before, back in China. But, but I don't know if you know this, if you take English classes in China, you don't learn American English. You learn British English. And I can always tell, because mostly it's the same language, but there are a few words that are a little bit different. Uh, so, for example, instead of a teacher, they call me a cunt. <laughs> subtle nuances. <laughs> the trained ear can pick up on that. <laughs> uh, so, not, not really, I don't really follow sports much, uh, which is a little, a little awkward sometimes. If you're a dude, people just expect you to know what's going on in the wide world of sports. I do just come up to you and start a conversation. I had this one guy at work come up to me and he said, hey, what do you think about that game? <laughs> and, I said, <laughs> and I said, what game? And he said, exactly, where were they? <laughs> High five on that one, buddy. We got it. You hear this guy, Jimmy? What game? Fucking nailed it. <laughs> Like, damn, I am killing it in this conversation. I have no fucking idea what I'm talking about. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm not a very alpha male personality. I don't want to shatter any illusions. I'm not a, I'm not, I, I, I did this one guy uh, last week. Uh, uh, well, he looked me right in the eye, okay? And he said, hey... What's new, Steve? I thought, my name's not Steve. I don't want to be a dick about it. So I'm Steve now. It's, uh, it's fine, it's fine. It's not even a big thing. Um, I uh, went, to, went to the doctor uh, the other week. Yeah, so I was gonna reading some uh, pamphlets in the doctor's waiting room. Uh, there was one, warning signs of depression. You know? uh, there's questions in it like, you know, do you ever feel like a failure? You know? Do you ever feel useless? And I was thinking, maybe that's, maybe that's, maybe I have depression. And then I remembered, oh no, I actually am a useless failure. <laughs> so it's okay. I'm not depressed. <laughs> I'm just perceptive. That's, that's good. I'm, not, I'm not depressed, but I'm also, I'm also not like really happy. Like, I'm not one of these happy people. Um, I, my attitude towards life is basically, uh, I can take it or leave it. You know, I'll go. Like, like, I'm not suicidal, but if I got hit by a car and I was lying in the street bleeding out, I just can't really see myself, you know, clinging to life. <laughs> Not me. Uh, I, uh, I, so, sometimes a comic will, will tell a joke and it, it doesn't really land. You know, and then be like, well, I, well, I'm sorry. Was that was that too real for you people? I was like, too soon. I have a, I've never seen a comic say, oh, I'm sorry, was that not funny enough? Because <laughs> nine times out of ten, you know, that's, 
that's actually the area that needs to be addressed. It's the not, not funny enough. All right. Uh, you, you guys have been really cool. Thank you very much. Let's give it up all the time for Sally Mullins. Not drinking these shoes. Wow, all right, stay sober.